Hello everyone, my name is Hideous Tuber and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are back with another episode of the Legacy Challenge. We are currently on... I don't know, we're on, we're on a episode. But currently we are in the process of having a club meeting. Um, we haven't had one in a while, which is crazy. But from last time, we did have a few issues getting our sims moved in together but we managed to get them moved in pretty well which is good so what we ended up doing is getting ourselves a club meeting just so we can get ourselves all sorted um and we did do some um little upgrades throughout the house which we'll show when we get back to the house we did end up tearing down and building a new house because quite honestly we needed a bit of an upgrade because Quite honestly, at some point we are going to end up, you know, having kids and all that. And honestly, the one bedroom house just wasn't going to cut it in the long run. So, quite honestly, the plan was to upgrade, at least add one more bedroom. So, at least two, maybe three kids can share the room for now. And then, you know, we can potentially add another room if necessary and, like, add it onto the bedroom itself. But, you know... For the meantime, it will work. Um, but we are currently, you know, hanging out with our club members, kind of talking to everyone that's around us at the moment. We bought some drinks so we can all drink, have fun, and all that sort of stuff. So that's kind of what we're planning on doing and kind of working on our family stuff as well as, um, as well as our, um, career. Because, um... In the last episode, I do believe we ended up getting all of our um, aspiration milestones done, so we no longer need to worry about that for the rest of the series. And so with that being said, it's just relationships and career left to go, which is great. Um, and yeah, that is kind of the plan going forward for the next few episodes. Alrighty, we are now back at the house. Um, it's been a few days, but we are about to find out something important, which is that we are now pregnant with our first child. Um, so basically, our, as I said, our goals was to expand our family with this, with our husband, and then um, work on our career even further, as well as work towards um, our aspirations as well, because we've still got to complete one um, collection which I'm sure we are really close because with the My Sims trophies we've got like two or three left before we are completely finished with it. I think we've only got a few more in the fossils so it's just a matter of like days before we complete at least one of them. So my plan was to stock up on a whole heap of them and then bulk open them and hopefully we will be able to at least complete one of them in that time frame so you know I'm sure we will get there eventually anyway. But that is essentially the plan going forward, is to be able to um, complete all of these, hopefully between now and by the time we reach an elder. So that way, once we reach an elder and our sims age up to a young adult, we can pick out heir, whoever that may be. Um, it will just depend on who's the most popular and or who, who I kind of vibe with as a sim the most. But that's kind of the plan going forward for the time being. Alrighty, it is now the next day and we've got like a whole heap of the uh, My Sims collectible trophies ready to be opened. So basically what my plan is, is that I'm just going to open them all up now and kind of hope to dear god I get them all. Which, honestly, as soon as I get this done I can just focus on the career at this point because I feel like trying to multitask and like do everything. Also, the collection is now complete and so with that being said, uh, we have now 100% completed the achievement of the curator so basically the plan is now because quite honestly we ha have now done that is pretty much because i do believe we still have a couple levels of the career still left to go so basically my plan is to you know have a few kids i kind of want between two and five i think so basically my plan is like once i have like between two and five I kind of would rather a larger amount, right? Um, so basically, I'm just going to work towards getting the career done, 
have the kids and then you know settle down and do all that but at the moment we are currently going to be putting in the um some bookcases so that we that way we can proudly display all of our my sims um trophies because we have a lot and i know since i we did end up having to bulldoze the house originally so i do think we are missing a couple of the my sims trophies that we haven't been able to recollect so obviously over time we will have to just recollect them and all that so obviously we will recollect those few that we we are currently missing and then we will um pretty much um pretty much display them all obviously once we hand the household over to the air or whatever uh, we will pretty much decide what to do with them at some point although I feel like with the ads we will probably move out and kind of start fresh almost um, and kind of just sort ourselves out from there because I feel like starting fresh would probably be the best option almost although I don't know how we will go about money because I feel like once we move out like this household would keep their money almost I don't know I don't know how that would work. Yeah, I guess, like, new family, yeah. I guess, although that's a really far away away, like probably 10 or so episodes away at this point, but you know, we will happily sort it out when it gets to that point. So, yeah. Honestly, I swear, after like, out, like over 20 minutes of playing, I find it always just like crazy that when you like, try and like get stuff done shit always happens to hit the fan for us because i swear like currently she's in the third trimester she is getting half a dozen phone calls to hang out i'm like woman i'm pregnant like why would i want to hang out when i'm probably on the verge of giving birth to someone or a human or whatever but you know it is what it is but he's going to be practicing some programming because I kind of want him to take up a couple of skills here and there. Just so during the, like, during, like, off time, he has something to do. Because I feel like he won't have anything to do. But obviously now she is going into labor. So we are going to be giving birth at the hospital. Mainly because I kind of want the birth certificate and all that. But we are now going to be going to the hospital. We are going to bring him with me. Um, you know. We'll see what ends up happening because like in the grand scheme of things <coughs> um like we won't know what happens whether it's a boy or a girl till now but because we have more control over him instead of a regular sim that we don't have mass control over he won't just like magically run off although he's in the process of freaking the heck out at the moment so you know he's gonna go sit in the corner and honestly, I don't blame him in all, in all honesty. And honestly, I feel like just waiting here takes a whole lot of time. And we put him in the corner, put baby in the corner. Which, you know, I mean, I kind of want him in the room. So that's kind of what we're going to do. He should make it there on time, even though he's probably about to have... He, he's so useful, guys. He's absolutely wonderful. He's so useful. Instead of being a supportive husband, he's running out of the room because he's panicking because of all the blood of whatever. So it's just like, absolutely wonderful. Alright, is it a boy, girl? What are we doing? It is a boy. So basically what I ended up doing was that I went to a website for name generations because I don't do, I don't, I'm not very creative with names. So I went to a name generator website that I've been going to for a while, especially like when I have to like do a whole heap of sins and all that. And I basically just end up um, pick getting a random name and honestly it ended up being something. I don't remember. I think it was Liam. But honestly it was a good name though. But, you know, I'm actually quite happy with how everything went and all that so I thoroughly enjoyed doing all this because I feel like it's crazy yeah it was Leo 
And it was only one baby, so thankfully we're all good in that department. Alrighty, we are now back at work. I think this is the first shift back since giving birth to our little baby, Liam. Um, we are currently just currently working on the case that we are assigned. Trying to get as many clues as we can so that way we can make an arrest and all that and so forth and so on. Um, I feel like with this, I feel like we're at the point where we're just trying to get through as much of the day as possible. Trying to get three stars and so on and so forth. Mainly because at this point I want to try and get promoted to sh Chief. Because I think Chief is the top one. I know that at some point we'll get like a few more levels here and there. Um, but I think there's like two or three more promotions before I hit level 10. And then after that I will probably just send her to work. On her own because at that point like there won't be any such point in going with her because there won't be any incentive unless it's like for a storyline or whatever but you know it's mainly what I'm going for is just to try and get those last couple of promotions set and all sorted so that way we don't have to necessarily worry about that going forward once we hit you know mid late adulthood for my sim but you know, now we have currently made an arrest. It's been a little bit later. It's I do believe it's the following day. We are now interrogating the sim. <laughs> this is probably going to be the last thing I do before we wrap up this episode. Because I typically don't want to make these episodes so long and tedious and all that. Because in the end of the day, that's just going to get old and boring and all that sort of thing. So, pretty much between this episode and the next episode, we'll probably try and have another child in the process and then work towards you know getting at least one more promotion since we've now gotten our collection and aspirations all sort of that's no longer our concern but you know that's kind of what we're trying to go for you know something i do love about you know my sim my sim at this point is that i feel like we're in a steady point that i feel like you know we've we're making a decent amount of money. We have a child, we have a husband, we're all good in that department. But I feel like, you know, I feel like at this point, I feel like we're still lacking in the social aspect because we've been like, oh, we've got to go to work, we've got to collect the aspirations, do all this, do all this, do all this. To the point where we haven't really focused on the social aspect in a while. So probably after next episode, we are probably going to focus on um, kind of getting our friendships with people up, going out, experiencing new things. So I may end up taking a few vacation days with the sim and just go out, have fun, talk to people, make friends, etc, etc. Just so that we can, you know, hang out with everyone. But this is where we're going to wrap up this episode. I will see everyone next episode. Until then, bye. Uh,